In this video, we'll take a look at some of the options that are available from the application's summon menu. For starters, the summon menu can be used either with your left hand or with your right hand. You can use the summon menu either two-handed, one hand to bring the menu up, the other to tap the buttons, or you can use the summon menu one-handed. Bring your hand up, and then if you quickly move it away, the menu will stay there so you can come back and interact with it with that same hand. Once the summon menu is up, if you move your hand away, it'll disappear on its own after a couple seconds. From the summon menu, there are a few different options that are available. You have the option here with the Tools button to tap the Tools button to bring the Tools menu up. We'll talk about that in a different video. You've also got the option to close the model, and we'll get back to that in a second. Another option is the Jump to Immersive Doohickey that's hanging out there in the middle of the summon menu. Cool thing about that is with the doohickey, you have the option to literally come and grab that doohickey out of the summon menu and then use it to drop yourself down into a SketchUp model and land in immersive mode in that model. So I'm now standing in the back courtyard of the Dance Center project. The model is at one-to-one -one scale and I can look or walk around inside the project. Now if you're in immersive mode, the summon menu will offer you the option to return to tabletop. Simply touch that button and the model will go back to being viewed in tabletop mode. 